Good morning, Warriors. It's Deja. And it's Ash. Welcome back to the 24th edition of Wakefield Action Media. We want to give a special shout out to the Special Olympics team for winning third place at their state competition last week. DECA competed at states this weekend and had four DECA club members, including me, become state finalists. The Wakefield Robotics team, the C, competed at the state level this weekend as well. Congrats to all our students who participated at the state level in the past few weeks. Wings and Cues is back and this week they talked to students who are state medal holders. What's up Wakefield? I'm Vike. Going back to Wings and Cues where the wings get harder and harder as the questions get harder and harder. And today I'm with the Wakefield state medalist. All I do is win, 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 no matter what. Got money on my mind. So what's your name and what is your medal like? My name is Kennedy and I medal in high jump. I'm Ben and I medal in high jump. I'm Quincy, I medal in the 4x8. I'm Maddie and I medal on beam for gymnastics. I'm Hosanna and I medal in pole vault. I'm Addie and I medaled in the 4x8. I'm AJ and I medaled in the 4x8. If you go in here, put your hands in the air, make them stay there. How was states and how was it different from other meets? Um, the energy was a lot more competitive and it was a lot louder than regular meets. Uh, the meet was a lot more stressful because the competition was a lot better. It was really fun seeing the beach and competing against such great athletes. I got to see people with a lot more difficult routines. Um, it was fun competing against really good athletes. It was nice to run on a bank track and I had fun at the beach. It was fun to run against people with better competition. So when did you start competing in your sport and why? I started high jump in sixth grade because I've seen a lot of other women do it, the pros, and I just wanted to do it too. Uh, I started last year because I was tall. I started last year because Hosanna convinced me to. I started when I was three because my mom put me into it. I started freshman year because I thought it would be fun. I started sophomore year to stay in shape after cross country. What lessons have you learned through your sport? To not let a bad day define you. To keep going even after you fail. Discipline and how to work as a team. Who has helped you improve the most and how did they help? My mom because she's been really involved and supportive of me. My pole vault coach, Coach Laura, because she finds new drills for me to do. Coach Sharp for always giving us hard workouts to make us ready for race day. Coach Sharp for always pushing me at meets and like trying to get me to do my best. Wait till you see what we do next. Come to gymnastics next year. We need you. The Heritage Assembly and International Night is this Friday. Here's more information. Hey Wakefield! Get ready for an exciting day and a night of celebration. Here in the main gym we will unleash your culture. And join us as we dive into a wide variety of traditions, music and history. On March 8th during the school hours and there will be international night during the evening. And our students will be holding another of their performances in the auditorium. But this time with traditional foods in the cafeteria. And in this town hall, you will see your culture on display, diving more into heritage. Make this day and night unforgettable. unforgettable. See you there. We talked to members from Amnesty International about their club. Hi, I'm Janelle, and I'm here with the Amnesty International Club. What is your club about? Amnesty International is a club where we focus on humanitarian crisis and advocate for victims of human rights violations. Amnesty doesn't take any political sides. We're just doing our small part to make a difference in the world. At past meetings, we've addressed the Israel-Palestine conflict, the Papua New Guinea protests, and other worldwide crises. We write letters, make posters, raise money, and at the end of each year, we do a banner hang. Why is it important? Because we shed light on human crisis and take action to support the victims. How can students join? You can join our Remind, follow us on Instagram, or come to our next meeting, which is March 20th in A102. We need more members. Make sure to pop out March 20th. See you there. That's it for this week. See you next Wednesday for another exciting, exciting edition. edition.